We own WGN Evening News at 6. Pursuing a degree debt free, some CPS graduates qualify to continue their education with free tuition at the City Colleges of Chicago. WGN's Gaynor Hall introduces you to one of the recipients of the City's Star Scholarship. My favorite, favorite line is nothing lasts forever. And there's even a song that says, any of the good thing that trouble doesn't last forever. And it don't last forever. Just keep going, keep pushing, and ask for help. Next month, 23-year-old Monique L. Harvey will graduate from Columbia College with a degree in television writing and production. I knew I wanted to go to college. There was no doubt about that. The question was, how was I going to get to college? Looking back, the road was rocky, with her mother facing mental health issues. I became homeless in high school. And Harvey recalls having no heat or hot water, taking showers at neighbors' homes, then couch surfing and sleeping in shelters. Everything happens for a reason. Even though it was a traumatizing time, I was able to come through and soar through it all. At Chicago Vocational High School, she connected with the trauma-focused Working on Womanhood program, or WOW. If I needed food, they'd give it to me. If I needed anything, you name it, clothes, shoes, food, money, they were there. And when she applied to the City Colleges of Chicago, she received a life-changing surprise. I got a letter, it's like, oh yeah, you, you know, not only qualify for financial aid, but you get to start a scholarship, which, which covers what financial aid does not, which I didn't know. So I was like, okay, wait, that sounds like it's free. <laughs> like, I can go to Kennedy King for free, and then I found out that Kennedy King had media, I was sold immediately. Get a 3.0 graduate. Former Mayor Rahm Emanuel launched the Star Scholarship in 2015 to boost interest in the seven city colleges and create a pathway to higher education for students in need. There are nearly 4,000 Star Scholars currently enrolled. And one of the biggest barriers for our students in the city uh, is the financial component. Dr. Gregory Thomas is president of Kennedy King College in Inglewood. Harvey graduated with an associate's degree in 2019, and she says she had a lot of fun building connections, hosting her own radio show, and serving in student government. I think it's a testimony of persistence on the part of Monique. Uh, she represents a great portion of our students that are balancing a lot of various variables uh, at home, uh, in their personal life, and working. Harvey is in stable housing now, and she also helps to take care of her little sister. Through the STAR partnership, she was able to transfer to Columbia, and with a combination of financial assistance, her entire college education was... Debt free, free 99. <laughs> Next up, she wants to pursue a master's degree in creative writing. She has her sights set on the entertainment industry and community outreach. I'm just thankful that I was able to get myself up and not give up because I was so close. She had a lot of help along the way, and that's a good thing. But you can't give up. You have to keep looking for resources, keep looking for support systems, because they're out there. Gaynor Hall, WGN News. And I'm so glad now, baby.